Hello everyone, welcome to... <laughs> Sorry, the cat's literally just jumped on the table as I started recording. Um, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your weekend messages reading. And it will be from the 23rd to the 24th of October 2021. Remember, these are mini tarot readings where we look at the potential of the energies that are around you for the next few days and they won't resonate with everybody, so just take what resonates with you. Okay, so let's get straight into it. Cancer, let's see what we have for you. This is for Cancer, Sun, Moon Rising and Venus. For those of you who are interested, I'm using the Druid Tarot deck. So let's see what we have for you. Okay, what do we have for our lovely Cancerians, please? Message for Cancer message for cancer okay we start with the hanged man high priestess lots of spiritual energy a lot of divinely guided energy in those cards as well cancer we have the ace of swords lovely bottom of the deck we have the Three of Wands. I love these cards together, these two. Okay. Well, the wait's going to be over, that's for sure. Because we have a beautiful new beginning, and it's a hard one new beginning. It's the hardest new beginning to get, the Ace of Swords. Because you can see those mountains, and they do look very steep, don't they? Somebody has to climb a lot of mountains. It's an effort to get to this new beginning. That's why it's called the victory card, the success card, because it can actually be to get this kind of breakthrough. And I do feel it is some kind of breaking the clouds in some way where you're finally seeing the blue sky. Um, there is some kind of breakthrough coming, but it hasn't been an easy one. We have the hanged man. Being in a period of limbo, being in a, a period of surrender, maybe just feeling a bit stuck as well. This can be an energy of where somebody is waiting for the breakthrough, waiting for the light bulb moment, waiting for the part in the sky to reveal the blue cap, blue clouds. So there is certainly an energy here of, we're in hanged man energies for a number of reasons. It can be in terms of changes in life, money, career changes. Uh, you know, sometimes we can feel stuck. Um, you know, sometimes if we lose, you know, job losses or job changes in some way, you know, that can make us feel in hangman mode. Uh, health areas could affect other areas of our life as well. We can feel in hangman mo mode. Relationship changes as well and so on and so forth. So that hangman is really poignant because it is in that period of reflection and being stuck that we get a lot of learning that we wouldn't necessarily have got had we not been in that period of stillness. This is a card of knowledge, you know, understanding and gaining wisdom and understanding from a tree of knowledge by being still. So I do feel in this energy, the message is, yes, this is an energy of waiting, but it's not been in vain. You've learned a lot, believe it or not, in this period. We have the High Priestess. Divine energy watching over you, guiding you, aligning you to your soul path. This is guiding you through your intuition, through dreams, through instinct, and in knowing, call it what you will. It's a very powerful energy, but there's certainly an energy that the universe is telling you. You've not been alone in this period of time. You've been watched over. I'm going to go to this, Cancer, because we have the Three of Wands. Somebody taking steps towards something, someone trying to manifest the beginnings of success here, the beginnings of something good coming their way. Uh, you can see they've taken two or three steps on a path, they've planted the wand and the wand is beginning to sprout. So this is the first signs of success coming. This is the first signs of something blossoming. And it's what you have taken energy and time towards but I feel you've been in that period of waiting, waiting for some level of good 
news or information or success, the first signs of success to come your way. The first signs of blossoming results here. We have the Ace of Swords, the Victory card, the breakthrough. This is a powerful breakthrough energy and it opens up a new beginning and it allows you to release from the hanged man point of view because this is an energy of finally I am getting the clarity that I need that you've been waiting for could be the first signs of success could be you know this is an energy of anticipating that there's success coming your way and this is a card of success um can be in the form of news communication some clarity that you've been waiting on Clouds are parting and you're seeing the blue sky. It's absolutely beautiful. So, yeah, what you've been waiting for, I feel, is, is happening. You know, this, like I said, it could be in health areas. It could be other areas of your life. You know, for some of you, this could be to do with moving or relocating. For others of you, it could be to do with business career. Final message for Cancer, please. Final message for Cancer. You see, I did say this, didn't I? You're not alone. High Priestess energy is right next to that hanged man. So we have Leaf Cutter Ant, Army of Life. Ask for help, seek support. You are not alone. It's not a journey that you've been taking on your own, this. And we have Sight Breakthroughs. Detach your emotions from situations that you cannot control. But I love that sight energy because I do see this, seeing that blue sky vision. And it is the beginnings of victory and success. I hope you enjoyed the reading. If you do, please do like, share and subscribe and I will see you next time. Thank you.